What's up everybody? I fired up my brick oven and it's at a steaming 700 degrees, which is a perfect temperature to cook some cod. Let's do this. I don't measure anything in this recipe, but if you want a list of ingredients with measurements, I will put everything in the description below. This is two pounds of fresh cod that I purchased earlier today at my local market. Start by adding some salt and capers in a large mixing bowl. I like to use raisins in this recipe, and if you're going to use them as well, you're going to need to hydrate them. You can use warm water for this, uh, or you can use the white wine that you're going to need to use later on in this recipe anyway. Add some black pepper and then some fresh garlic. I like to give it a rough chop because the larger pieces are less likely to burn when it's in this oven. Next, add some extra virgin olive oil. And I almost forgot, make sure you add parsley. Uh, give it a rough chop like I am here. Now let's mix everything up. I'm gonna add a little bit more olive oil here because it does look a little dry. Place your fish in the bowl and mix it well until everything is coated. For the best results, transfer all of this into a Ziploc bag and let it sit for several hours in your refrigerator. To make sure that the fish is evenly cooked throughout, I'm going to fold the thinner part underneath the section of this strip. That way the fish is somewhat even in thickness. Now we're ready to dress it up. Add some more olive oil, then add some white wine. Sprinkle some unseasoned breadcrumbs on top and finish it off with some grated parmigiano. You want your oven to be very hot, so I'm adding another log here. At this point, we are at about 700 degrees Fahrenheit, which is about 370 Celsius. Fish is a fairly easy thing to cook in a wood-fired oven because it cooks very quickly and it doesn't burn in extreme temperatures like this. You can easily cook this in your kitchen oven as well. All you need to do is preheat it to 400 degrees Fahrenheit and when you're ready to cook, set it to broil. Then place your fish in the middle rack of your oven. Now the real question is how do you know when it's ready? When you see that golden brown coloring on the top, it should be ready. To be certain, you can stick a fork in it and if it goes through easily, it is cooked all the way through. Mmm, it smells amazing. It is, it is perfectly cooked, and because it's so hot in that oven, it only took a few minutes. Incredible. All I need is a piece of bread. We're perfect here. The recipe is in the description below. Thank you so much for watching. Subscribe if you're not already subscribed, because more of these are going to be coming as, as the weather changes and it gets warmer. Thanks again, everybody. Have a good one.